The family in Kyoto. One Japanese girl got freedom. Written by Hidemi Woods. Narrated by Hidemi Woods. Just clearing your eyes. My father was an attentive father. He treated me so nicely throughout my childhood. My mother didn't like how he treated me because she believed he was just spoiling me. Every time he did a nice thing to me, she got angry. To avoid her anger, he had learned to give me a treat without her presence. Near my home was a temple famous for the five-storied pagoda, and a fair was held along the approach to it once a month. A relative of ours had a booth at the fair, and my father helped carry merchandise every month. He never forgot to get some toys for me there when his work was done. There was no greater pleasure for me than seeing him entering the house waving some playhouse items to me. Of course, he was scolded by my mother when she caught it. I usually slept beside my grandparents, and I had suffered from chronic insomnia in my childhood. Once in a while, I had a happy occasion to sleep with my parents when my grandparents were on their trip. On one of those occasions, my mother was taking a bath when my father came to Futon next to me. Since my parents didn't know about my insomnia, he was surprised I was still awake. He thought I couldn't sleep because I was too hungry. Not to be caught by my mother, he stealthily got out of the room, sneaked into the kitchen, made a rice ball, and brought it to me. He told me to finish it before my mother came out of the bathroom. Seeing me devouring it, he said that he had never made a rice ball by himself before and didn't know how. It was surely the ugliest rice ball, but the most delicious one I had ever had. My mother also didn't like to see me cry. She had told me not to cry because crying made me look like an idiot. While my little sister cried all the time, I tried not to as hard as I could. But as a small child, I sometimes couldn't help it, and my mother would get angry with me for crying. In those cases, my father always said to me, You're not crying, are you? You're just clearing your eyes, right? I had noticed until recently that there are the exact words in my song, Sunrise. I've put his words unconsciously. Audiobooks by Hidemi Woods First audiobook, Japanese Dream by Hidemi Woods on sale at online stores or apps. Second audiobook, My Social Distancing and Naked Spa in Japan by Hidemi Woods on sale at online stores or apps. Apple Books, Audible, Google Play, Nook Audiobooks, 43 available distributors in total.